Welcome to W News. I've never encountered somebody who doesn't desire to increase their income, even when they lie about it, their behavior usually exposes them. You want a better education so that you might increase your earning potential at work. You search for scholarships so that someone else will pay for your high-quality education. Before we continue please do not forget to like, comment and subscribe to our channel for more knowledgeable news. Please tell us in the comment section where you are listening from so that we can give you a shout out. Today's shout out goes to Xipin in China. Which industries have generated the most wealth, as you put it? Which sectors are expanding the quickest? By providing answers to questions like these, you can discover your core passions and interests. Let's examine the seven sectors that have produced the most billionaires in the present. Number 7. Solar Energy. In both my house and my workplace, I utilize an inverter system. However, barely 1 in 15 or 20 people I meet utilize renewable energy. It's considered to be pricey by many. In the long term, it is less expensive than running and maintaining a generator, which they might not be aware of. If I were to launch a new company today, I would think about selling and installing solar panels and inverters, and I would concentrate my marketing efforts on informing consumers of the benefits of utilizing an inverter as opposed to a generator. Renewable energy sources have a big market, especially in emerging nations where the national power supply is unstable. Number 6 Media and Entertainment Industry Avengers, Endgame generated over $2.79 billion in box office receipts. But to profit from this sector, you don't have to be as large as Marvel Studios. The fact that the media and entertainment sector has one of the lowest entrance barriers of any sector, owing to digital media technologies, is one of its main draws. Additionally, it is not based on academic credentials. In this industry, even the weakest student may succeed. But I must confess that they can also be disadvantages because there is less of a barrier to entry, which leads to increased competition and makes it harder to stand out. In the media and entertainment sector, there is a lot of money to be made. People will always want to be entertained or informed about the world around them. If you can be inventive enough to stand out, movies, music, video games, TV, and the technology that make them possible are money makers. Number 5. Healthcare. We can all agree on one thing health is wealth, regardless of where we reside. More than anything else in recent memory, the COVID 19 worldwide epidemic has brought this fact to our notice. Everything else collapses when the health sector is endangered. Over a trillion dollars are invested in the pharmaceutical sector globally. But that is only a small portion of the health industry. The negative is that, for legitimate reasons, the health industry is more heavily regulated than most others. Despite this, there are several chances for substantial wealth creation in the health industry. Number 4. Food and Beverages There are nearly 7 billion mouths to feed on the planet. We'll have an additional billion people by 2030. And by 2050, there will be 9.7 billion mouths that need to be fed every day. Currently, we are not generating enough food to adequately feed everyone on the earth. More people will desire high-quality food and drinks as more people are lifted out of poverty. Critical thinking is not necessary to see the potential of the food and beverage sector. As a person who has invested in agriculture for more than three years, I can attest to the fact that there are a lot of chances in this sector. Number 3. Real Estate and Construction The earliest known source of wealth is real estate. Whether it's for personal or professional reasons, shelter is a basic human need. Consequently, one of the most established and inclusive sectors for wealth creation is real estate. By inclusive, I mean that it is accessible to as many individuals as are eager to participate. The majority of affluent people either became wealthy through real estate or increased their fortune through it. The value chain for the real estate sector is lengthy and includes everything from purchasing properties to building, upkeep, administration, expert services, cutting-edge security, and other connected operations. Real estate is the best option if you want to increase your wealth. Number 2. Technology 
Next to financial services, technology is responsible for the second highest number of millionaires. Actually, one industry serves as a stimulant for the other. Like nothing ever imagined before, the union of the financial services industry and technology has produced huge riches. And now, those businesses serve as the foundation for other sectors. The younger generation has done particularly well while using technology. In a world of more than 7 billion people without technology, I can't even begin to think what the unemployment rate would have been. Without the chances that technology has given the younger generation, the economic situation in this region of the world would have been disastrous. In actuality, no other sector of the economy produces money as quickly as technology. The technology sector is unique in that it touches every sector of the economy. In addition to the banking, media, health, and retail sectors, the agricultural industry also requires technology. Additionally, it offers space for technical, sales, and support staff. Everyone can find a position in the technology industry. Number 1. Financial Services According to the Wealth Report, the financial services sector has produced the most millionaires in recent times. The money industry generates a lot of revenue. The most prosperous businesses in the world today are run by individuals and groups who are adept at raising and managing capital. Consider this, a financial organization, such as a commercial bank, investment bank, hedge fund, insurance company, or wealth portfolio, manages all of the money that individuals earn worldwide. And consumers often use a financial institution to transact with their money. The finance sector serves as the cornerstone of the global economy. The finance sector was frequently the source of the majority of historical economic crises. Hope you have an amazing journey in one of these. Thank you for listening. <laughs>